Okay, everyone, I'm doing a little bit of a, a new series, maybe, potentially, where we check out some top posts on Reddit. Uh, I'm a big fan of Reddit. I spend a lot... I, I thought someone was mowing the lawn, and I was like, right now, at 4.30 p.m.? Okay, just in front of me. Thank you. Uh, um... I just do this. <laughs> I can't do much about that. I can't do much of that. Anyway, anyway, um, I got my coffee. It's yeah, I get my it's it's my coffee girl. You know, she just brings me my coffee. Anyway, as I was saying, yeah, uh, I spent a lot of my time on Reddit, and I thought, you know what? Let's check out some top posts that would be relevant to us, like you know, the top posts of all time on r slash gaming i might need to zoom this in a little bit do i do i need to zoom it in a bit zoom 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 yeah that's a little bit better you know you know this is a good place when they've got the triforce uh i don't know how does this do like light mode at all or is is it just like this all the time anyway let's go to the top posts of all time and see what everyone in the gaming sphere says is the best My eyes. Do you guys know how I got so tan? I mean, I look really white right now. Maybe I need to make my webcam bigger. Do you know how I... Do you know how I got to be so tan? It's because I have a, a monitor and I use light mode all the time. So I get the rays on my face. You're white as fuck. Okay, shush. Shush, 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 shush. Let's check this out. 269 upvotes? This has got to be good. Showing a game you mastered for many years to someone you care about. Okay, now pray. Oh. Oh. Okay. See, I'm not like this. I'm not like this. I sit there because I don't want to be a backseat gamer, but there's every single iota of my being is screaming at the person playing to do the thing that they're supposed to, like if it's a puzzle and I've done it before, in my head it's like, dude, just, you gotta go left one block and then you're in. And I just don't, I, it, it's so hard. It's so hard. I don't, I'm not like, I, I feel like a lot of people that I play with or that I'm like playing games with don't like backseat gaming. I don't mind backseat gaming too much. Not like when I'm. Not only do I bring you coffee, okay. but I give you my soul. I mean, my tier three <laughs> sub. Thank you for your soul. I mean, uh, the tier three sub. I appreciate it. My coffee girl really coming through in the clutch. But like, for example, I don't think I'd play a game with Vixella, for example, and tell her everything and what to do. So, you know. Um, and speaking of gaming, thank you so much for the Prime Gaming. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to the Baguette Brigade. But yeah, so I, I don't, this is how kind of... I'm surprised this... Reddit confuses me. Actually, the whole internet confuses me. You know, Twitter just came out with a new, like, story mode. And they ha it's called Fleets. Can we not? I have enough... I should ask out the coffee girl. No, nah, she's way out of my league. Anyway, let's see what's on next. I got off the horse by accident right before a cutscene in Red Dead. Oh, this is going to be good. Do I need to make this? <laughs> Wait, no way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up, hold up, hold up. It might look shit if I make it SD. Uh, yeah. Oh, All right, we'll just watch this. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? I just did the voiceover. <laughs> run! Run, Arthur, run! You can do it! Go! 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 <laughs> I love it when people find glitches like this. It's so good. Dude, run. <laughs> oh, that's so good. 
No, I don't want to watch the GIF again. That is so good. <sighs> that deserves the 227,000 upvotes that I got. All right. What's well, the perfect cosplay doesn't exist? Okay. <laughs> this is the smallest thing I've ever seen. Um, do I have to open it in a new thing? All right. I think I've seen this one. I think this one's... Yeah. Yeah. This is the one from uh, South Park. This one's pretty popular. It's made the... It's made the rounds. Wait for it. Nice. Oh. <gasps> They're so good. I Did someone do a comparison? I feel like someone should have done a comparison. <laughs> if you haven't seen Make Love Not War Warcraft it from South Park, it is just... Just go watch it. If you've played World of Warcraft, you'll enjoy it a lot more. I think Sasha and I... I got into World of Warcraft a little bit when WoW Classic came out. And Sasha's a huge nerd. She's actually playing it right now. And... It's just... After playing that, and then we watched the episode, it's just so funny. Because you understand a little bit more of the references and stuff. That's a good one. Yeah, that's a classic. Uh, so this was just... This must have been a repost. Damn, I gotta repost something. I need to get my, like, what, how many... I've got 36 Reddit points. It's terrible. It's 1am. Let's play until we lose. So an all-nighter. Oh. Definitely not me when I play any online video game. Oh. Do you remember this chat? <laughs> I'm literally about to play The Sims 4, their new, like, pack that they've released. And this is there. <laughs> uh, good times. Good times. All right. As a teen in the 80s, my conservative, God-fearing family wouldn't let me own Dungeons & Dragons. Let a, late, 30 years later... I learned how to read. Also, my son and I are starting our own D&D journey. Oh, this is cute. Ah, That's just wholesome. I bet you this was also posted in wholesome. I think... I think sharing passions with your children is really cool. And I think that it creates a bond between parent and child that is... Will never be broken. It's very cute. If I, have, if I ever have kids, we're skateboarding, snowboarding, and um, playing Minecraft. <laughs> uh, wait, EA? why is EA on here twice? Like, literally, they're just a post in between. What? EA, you got... EA removed the refund button on their web page, and now you have to call them. Okay. <laughs> Good on EA! All right, train, train simulator is so immersive. Nice. Is there actually a simulator? Wait, hold up. Wait, what? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Train simulator. Wait, I can... Get on a train right now? Do you just sit? <laughs> Do you just sit down and just ride the rails? <laughs> what the hell? Routes. Let's go. We're going to Hogwarts. Do they have a Hogwarts one? Maybe. That'd be fun. Yeah, isn't this like if I go to Steam, right? And then I go... What is this called? Train Simulator. I think if you get every single DLC, this ends up being like a million dollars. Yeah, look, browse 606, right? 606 things. See all. <laughs> what? I want to look at all 606. Cause it, does it tell me how much it is for everything? Oh... I want to know. That's scary. You guys are like, oh, I ha I mean, I think The Sims 4, if you buy every single pack now, is like 700 bucks or something. But this is like thousands of dollars. Wait, I want to look it up. 
How much is Train Simulator with all DLC? What? What? That is... I need to zoom in on that. What? $10,000. <laughs> Chat. It's time to invest in Train Simulator. Warning huge pick. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, that's insane. I... Oh, man. Uh, the internet is a, a wild place, everyone. Very, very wild. All right. Actual math teacher recording and teaching actual math in Half-Life Half -Life Alex. That's cool. I obviously, I think one of the coolest things that I've seen on Reddit, because sometimes I see like what's the top posts of like the last day. And a lot of teachers are getting really creative in the way that they're trying to teach. And this is sick. This is such a cool thing. Because I think it, this would have like so much engagement from their students. Because number one, you're in a video game. And number two, it just is awesome. <laughs> I mean, sometimes if you need to write this down, you're like, all right, he wrote angles. It'd be very hard. But this is cool. This is really cool. I miss virtual reality. I want virtual reality. Pepe hands. Anyway, I found out today that my grandpa ordered a better gaming rig than myself and all my friends. Let's go. My dad. Actually, this this could be my dad. I... On my Instagram page. Actually, let's go to Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram... <laughs> Lots of followers, uh, popular posts like this, and me and all my friends during quarantine. And then, oh, that was actually a really cute one. I like my shitty ones. My shitty ones are my favorite pictures. Anyway, um, where was it? Wait, did I not post it? I swear I had to post it. Oh, here. This one. Yeah, so momentum. It was, man, this was two years ago. Jesus. Uh, yeah, so this company actually makes Formula One, like, simulators. I think they've become really popular now since, obviously, COVID has made all the F1 drivers go from home. And they have these at home. It's insane. And I remember when I did this, my dad was like, get the name of the company. I want to buy one. And then he realized they're, like, 30 grand and was like, I have no room nor, nor the money. <laughs> but this is really cool. This was like one of the coolest experiences that I've like experienced with VR. It was really like jolty though. The photo of Mama Zeus in the shirt. Oh uh, yeah, my mum, my mum acting here, and then my mum thinks I'm cool. She does. My mum really thinks that I'm cool. I don't know why. Maybe because, you know, she's my mum. Anyway, moving on. This is really cool. This is really cool. I wonder what game they'll be playing. I'm kind of envious of his setup. She's cooler than you. Hey! <laughs> they asked him what gaming chair he was using. I've seen this. This is good. <laughs> uh, green screens. Gotta love them. <gasps> Maybe I could green screen in like a uh, one of the new Logitech Herman Miller chairs that I want real bad. That are sixteen hundred dollars. <laughs> All right, net neutrality. What happened with this? What happened with net neutrality? Net neutrality was repealed a year ago. All right. So, wait. So that is that a good thing? It's been a year since net, net neutrality was repealed. This was, they screwed us over. Oh, so they, so we got fucked. Oh, okay. I think, is it everyone or was it just the states? Because I feel like the states just keeps getting fucked. I think 2000, 2018 was like the dawn of everything to come. 
just the states. I think you the Europe had something going on. It was the FCC? Oh, damn. oh. A political. Oh wait, I just clicked the first one. I want I want his um, jit pi tweets. Where's the mean tweets? Hi, I'm Ajit Pai. I'm the chairman of the FCC. I really enjoy the public debate about the future of the internet. Hey, fuck you. All right. I'm done. All right. Um, yeah, I've seen the Cody Co video. <laughs> of course I've seen that. Of, of course. Who hasn't seen the Cody Co video? Hmm? Anyway. <laughs> I want to punch him. He just has that face and that attitude. I, if you haven't seen the Cody Co video, go watch it because it's like watching that video that I just played, but with friends who are way funnier than you are. <laughs> it's a good time. Or it's just like watching a video with friends. It's good. All right. Intimidation at its finest. All right. Damn. All right. I have no skills like that. That'd be so cool. It's, I think one of the greatest things that consoles have added is the fact that you can actually clip parts of your video, like your, your gameplay now, which is so good. Because when shit like that happens, because we all have had something that's happened epic like that, and but you've had no way to show it like anyone. But now you can do it on consoles. And I think if you have like NVIDIA graphics card, you can do like Shadow Play or something. Which is also very cool. Anyway, oh, I am the guy, I'm that guy that makes sculptures in Minecraft. Here's my latest and only sculpture for 2018. I call it Aquasomnia. Aquasomnia. This is probably gonna be so cool. Okay, it's taking forever to load. Maybe I should open it in its original. Dude, wait, what? What? How do I hire this pu- What? I didn't even notice that it was a woman. Holy shit. Okay, I built a reactor in modded Minecraft. I'm, I'm, I actually haven't completed it yet. And I'm like, man, <laughs> good on you, Zeus. That reactor is looking fine. <laughs> it's a five by five block, like five by five by five. And I'm impressed with that. But this, holy shit. Uh, a friend of mine in Australia, Kira, she used to, um, she used to stream making pixelated artworks in Minecraft. It's, it's insane. There's, it's so cool. I just don't have the patience for that. I could watch this for years as well. This is very, very cool. And as you can see, the, it took them a full year to do. The true art takes time. These have got a lot of upvotes. You know what? Upvo this is an archive post. Oh. Okay. Anyway, uh, both photos of me, two years and 220 pounds lighter. Why were you Mario here and then Luigi there? It should be Luigi here, then Mario here. Mario's the better one. We all know that. Luigi is skinnier. He's taller, isn't he? All right, so Luigi in Super Mario, G oh. 31 kilos. Wario's 301 kiri uh, kilos. Who the fuck is Ali G? Wait, what the fuck is this? Man, I'm stumbling onto weird parts of the internet. I don't like this. Welcome to Reddit, everyone. <laughs> if you've never seen or been to Reddit, it leads you down dark paths. Don't go to it. Don't go to it. But I will. Let me be your vessel. 
Uh, been gaming with this. Oh, I saw this. Uh, I can upvote this. Yes. Been gaming with this dude for 15 years since Rainbow Six Vegas on the 360. Very cool. I have some good gaming memories with him. He tried to, um, he tried but couldn't get one. Little did he know I was about to get him one. Looking forward to playing another generation. So he got him a, a PS5. That is so cool. It's so cool. This is like humans being bros. Totally wholesome. I just wish someone did that for me. <laughs> no, this is uh, very wholesome. And this was posted three days ago and has 162,000 upvotes. Very, very, very good. Um, you know, the the I think my... Let me read you something. I think my dad sent... Or my mom sent me this. Um... Can't type in my mum. Might have been my dad. <laughs> oh, here we go. He sent me a, he sent me an act of kindness thing, right? There's a story from Catherine Catherine Hepburn's childhood. I don't know who Catherine Hepburn is. I don't know if she's related to Audrey. Anyway, it says <clears throat> is this just the act of giving and why it's very important. And I think this is very apparent in uh, Sasha's life. Not so much mine, because I don't have a lot to give other than my humor. But she's extremely generous uh, in general, just with her time and her money. So, uh, once when I was a teenager, my father and I were standing in line to buy tickets for the circus. Finally, there was one other family between us and the ticket counter. This family made a big impression on me. There were eight children. You know, this is from a long time ago. Eight children. Who's having eight children these days? Anyway, uh, all probably under the age of 12. The way that they were dressed, you could tell that they didn't have a lot of money, but their clothes were neat and clean. The children were all well-behaved, unlike children of these days. Uh, <laughs> all of them standing in line, two by two, behind their parents holding hands. Very wholesome. They were excitedly jabbering about the clowns, animals, and all the acts that they would be seeing that night. For their excitement... You could set, um, by their excitement, you could sense that they had been, never been to the circus before. It would be a highlight of their lives. The father and mother were at the head of the pack, standing proud as could be. The mother was holding her husband's hand, looking up to him as if to say, you're my knight in shining armor. Man, I wish someone would look at me that way. Uh, he was smiling and enjoying seeing his family happy. The ticket lady asked the man how many tickets he wanted. He proudly responded, I would like to buy eight children's tickets and two adult tickets so I can take my family to the circus. The ticket lady stated the price and the man's wife let go of his hand. Her head dropped. The man's lip began to quiver. Then he leaned <clears throat> a little closer and asked, how much did you say? The ticket lady again stated the price. The man didn't have enough money. How was he supposed to turn and tell his eight kids that he didn't have enough money to go to the circus? Seeing what was going on, my dad reached into his pocket, pulled out a $20 bill, and then dropped it on the ground. We were not wealthy in any sense of the world, but my father bent down. I was in parentheses, by the way. My father bent down, picked up the $20, and tapped the man on the shoulder and said, Excuse me, sir, this fell out of your pocket. The man understood what was going on. He wasn't begging for a handout, but certainly appreciated the help in a desperate, heartbreaking, and embarrassing situation. He looked straight into my dad's eyes, took my dad my dad's hand in both of his and squeezed tightly under the $20 bill. And with his lip quivering and a tear streaming down his cheek, he, he replied, thank you. Thank you, sir. This really means a lot to me and my family. My father and I went back to our car and drove home. The $20 that my dad gave away was what we we're going to buy our own tickets with. Although we didn't get to see the circus that night, we both felt joy inside that was far greater than seeing the circus uh, could ever provide that day i learned the value to give the giver is bigger than the receiver if you want to be large larger than life learn to give love has nothing to do with what you are expecting to get only with what you are expecting to give which is everything the importance of giving blessing others can never be overemphasized because there's always joy in giving learning to make someone happy by acts of giving and that's very true 
It is. It, it's a very important life lesson, and I think. I think consumerism has made us a very selfish. Uh, has made us very selfish. And it's really nice when people are generous in that in that sense. So just think about that. I just like that, you know? I think it's a good way to live life. Anyway, yeah, that's why these wholesome memes get upvoted so much as well. Um, so if you're wholesome and... I remember... Actually, I do have another story quickly before I get completely sidetracked again. Uh, I remember James. <laughs> James came home uh, when I was living with him a couple of years ago. And he goes, I gave $50 to like a homeless guy who was like watching. He was like always at an intersection on the drive home from the city. We would always see him. And he's like, I gave him 50 bucks today. And, uh, and I was like, oh, that's like, uh, that's really lovely of you. And he goes, I had to tell someone cause I can't tweet it out. Cause I'll just sound like a pompous asshole <laughs> doing it for likes. And I just thought it was so funny. And he told Delhi, right. And Delhi tweeted it out. <laughs> but James James is also yeah very very ge- I have very generous friends very generous friends but I just thought that was so funny <laughs> yeah being ge- it, there's a lot of a lot of joy in being in making someone's day just by giving very relevant just a reminder if you're buying more than I need to upvote this. Just a reminder, if you're buying more than one PlayStation or Xbox for the purpose of reselling, you're literally a piece of shit. I was on eBay the other day. I'm hoping this doesn't show. Um, man, I've got a story for every post. Um, all right, okay. I changed my, I, I changed the address. Okay. <clears throat> so I've been looking for a new graphics card. I just want all of us to appreciate this. Okay. RTX 3080. They literally got sold out in an instant. Okay. I just want you to have a look at how many fucking results there are. 558 results. Uh, Veerly, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Bast. Very, very kind of you. The gift of giving. In the spirit of giving. Thank you so much. I, I really appreciate that. I wasn't trying to like bait any subs or anything. I just think that it's it's just nice. Um, but 558 people. 558 people fall under this fucking category, right? I just want to see PS5. Okay, we got to go video game consoles. I just... Why? I, I don't know if this is like uh price shipping. I don't know if this includes oh yeah, includes all this crap. But a lot of it is just like a lot of it. Eleven thousand. Eleven thousand PS fives. Eleven thousand people. No, how close are we? We're at twelve thousand people have done this. That's Xbox One X. But this is just the thing. You know how I just talked about the act of giving? (laughs) This is the fucking opposite. (laughs) It's so ridiculous. Yeah, okay. Um, Yeah, PS5s. PS5s, Xbox Series X, they go for 500 bucks. That's how much they are. And people are selling them for 1200. I don't like this. It's, It's not a great... It just sucks. It really does. Because, you know, there's a lot of people out there who are on a tight budget, want to buy one to give their kids a a Christmas present, you know? And people are making bots so they can buy one and get rich. And it's just, I don't like this. It's very annoying. Anyway, this one goes out to all the Twitch gamers who try their best. Hey, that's me. (laughs) What up? (laughs) I think that's me, right? Three hours later. Oh, thanks for watching my stream, everyone. Uh, Plug. 
want zero viewers. Pog champ. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. I'll upvote that. Um, red versus blue was way ahead of a time. I never watched this. I know James was big into this, and a couple of more, a couple of my friends in at school were. Are you a man or a woman? I am a villain. What gender are you? Evil. Yeah, but what's in your pants? <laughs> Damn. Nice. Nice. I built a chainsaw carving simulator in VR. What do you think? Wait, what? <laughs> Hog. It's so cool. Man, everyone's so bloody talented. I made another cyberpunk scene in Minecraft. What? Upvote. That's my act of giving, by the way. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? Man. I like, I'm like, I, I've just, I have no accomplishments like this in terms of my artistic ability. Just because I don't have one. You, you guys remember the, the wait, is, is, is the Zeus, oh, wait, no, no, no. The, remember the old Zeus R emote? Remember the one I made? I'll never forget. And then you have Zeus mining. Okay, shush, all right? <laughs> this is, this is also something that's very relevant. I remember, I remember playing this. Oh, okay. A uh, little bro has been saving. Yeah, look at this. See, little bro has been saving up for a PS4. So big bro surprises him with one for his birthday. Oh, so sweet. I remember I bought my brother something and he didn't like it. I spent my hard earned money on it. I think it was like on two video games for him and he didn't even care. <sighs> That's really, uh, see, you know, that, that, that 11,000 people who are fucking scalping PS5s. That one's for you because you can't see this. These moments aren't happening because of, the, of you. Oh, that's very generous. Very nice. It's VR jing, but your fingers get longer every time you move. Wait, what? Oh no. Oh no. This is Ah, oh, it's out of my nightmares. What the fuck? Ah. No. Enough. Enough's enough. It's a work in progress, but this is his and her setup so far. Uh Sasha. Sasha, check this out. Some ideas for the new house. Terrifying Tuesday with, with VR. Yeah. This looks photoshopped. Yeah. It's because of the lighting in the back. Um, It looks good, though. This would be so comfortable. I don't think Sasha's watching. Pepper hands. Playing Spider-Man when I found a building that looked a little familiar. What? Wait, what the... F I forgot how detailed Spider-Man is. Oh, speaking of Spider-Man, um, supposedly there's like DMCAable music in a cutscene that you can't turn off. So literally, some some streamers have been told that they cannot play it because they will be banned in the Miles Morales one. So that kind of sucks. Well, I don't even have a PS5. I know you can play it on the PS4, but I'll just wait till I get a PS5, and then by then, hopefully Twitch has saved, you know, saved their DMCA stuff, okay? And then we'll have the tools in order to be able to do that. <sighs> it is a shame. I mean, shit. Did you guys see this today? I think this is the one. You see this? Project 007. I'm gonna have a DM. I've gotta be careful. I, I don't think I'm gonna get...
I'll risk the DMCA. Fuck it. Ah. <laughs> uh, man, my... My childhood was spent playing Nightfire and Goldeneye. So good. I'm so excited for that. <laughs> and DMCA. I was going to make a tweet about it today. I think there's a lot of, like tweets or oh, not a lot. there's a lot of in the twitch community they're just like saying oh can't play this gonna be dmca'd it feels like that a lot cheek oh wait how many of you remember cheat codes just delete the vod yeah but i hate having to do that it kind of sucks cheat codes we had a cheat book i remember looking up cheat codes for um vice city and gda3 Oh, now, do you know the cheat code? Yeah, the cheat codes now are this. It sucks. It really sucks. I, I think I think the best DLCs that I've seen done have been The Witcher 3. All their DLCs are really worth it. Um and then I feel like who keeps coming out with like just new editions of stuff? I think Stardew does a really good job. Hell. Freaking Minecraft. Like, what you can do with Minecraft is insane. And it's just all free. You know, you just pay for Minecraft once, and then that's that's it. I'm not that good. I'm a little nervous. Maybe playing some of these. Not that good, but this happened. Do I need to do that, chat? Do I need to do that in a fucking video game for you guys to finally accept that I am actually good at driving in video games? What do I need to do to make you satisfied? Yes, if you can. Oh, I... They just said I'm not that good! When I was a kid, I used to play The Floor is Lava with Shadows. Wait, what? What? Oh, this is sick. This is such a cool concept. You're like a frog and you can jump into the shadows. That is sick. That's a really cool idea. <laughs> uh, Story-driven RPGs. Okay, uh, this is going to be an attack on me, isn't it? Welcome to the story-driven RPG. I'm the chosen one, aren't I? Or some kind of bullshit prince heir to the throne. Wait, not necessary. And that's the villain. Just look at his face. It's begging for world domination. And probably that moron over there is going to abandon his life and goals just to join me on my quest because that's normal. Or let me guess, the world is in danger and crystals are somehow involved. Wait, what? This guy seems like such a negative Nelly. Just enjoy it. This is like James when we play fucking video games together. It Like, when we played A Way Out, I don't think I've heard someone complain so much about a child and their relevance in a, in a video game ever before. If, you're un if you don't know what I'm talking about, you just go watch our... Uh, I think it's on the Flabaliki channel. Just go watch our whole A Way Out series. <laughs> anyway, I'm developing a multiplayer game with you hunt ghosts. Oh, is this... Wait, what? Wait, what? What is this game? M Midnight Ghost Hunt. Wait, what? That my me just buying train simulator? Oh, when does it come out? Wait, is this kind of like, oh, it's a hide and seek multiplayer game. God damn it. The problem with this, play easy, yeah, see, that this is the problem. So, for those who don't know, uh, Dead by Daylight came out three years ago, and then it did really, really well. It's still doing really well. And then everyone wanted to do a four, like, it was like 4v1 or like, a, like one baddie and then a bunch of goodies, right? Uh, a bunch of people, so like one v so many. I don't like that anymore. 
I want all of us to go against one AI. And that's what Phasmophobia does. And I love that. And he, whoever developed it, there's only one person developing it, by the way. They said that all they were doing was they are making sure that it was just going to be AI versus players. And it's not going to ever change. And I love that. I mean, if you want to play a, as a monster, there's a thousand and one video games that do that. This is cool. I like this concept, but there should be an AI version where you all go up and you have to fight them. It's like a hybrid. Bill Gates selling the first copy of Halo 3 at Best Buy. Fucking scalpers. <laughs> EA deleted my art. Why is EA like on the front page here all the time? I'll upvote this because I can. Uh, EA deleted my origin account and EA's EA help is totally ignoring me. Oh, I can't be bothered to go through that. The Silver Snipers are CSGO's team in Sweden where the youngest member is 62. Dude. If I was a company, I'd sponsor the crap out of these people. That's so cool. Old people playing video games is so sweet. So sweet. Is anyone else guilty? Brain, do some work. Body, go to the gym. Me, I shall consider both of your proposals when I play video games for the next eight hours. Fuck would do that. No! Dude, this person's so... Just the way that it's all done is so lovely. The perfect marionette. How do you come up with a concept like this and then do it? So cool. The best thing of gaming. And this guy has a couple of posts that have done well. I did it! I won! Mom, I won against Andrew. It's great, sweetie. Dad, I won! Did, did he really win or did you let him win? Does it really matter? <sighs> yep, my brother never did that. He made sure that I would never just play because he would always play. I wasn't allowed to. Ubisoft has a new logo. I actually like the new Ubisoft logo. I know, I remember seeing this. I remember. I remember. I can't up for him. Gaming legend. Um, employees thanking local customers after a second Sega store in Akihabara closes after 17 years. Damn. As the oldest sibling crushing the younger one in a game is the only option and you wonder why you know your brother's always using the internet <laughs> practicing why jedi should never come to the dark side of the map what? force push <laughs> nice i'm just closed Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, true. Wait, it's... Oh, that's right. I forgot it was on PS5 as well. I wouldn't know because I don't have one because people keep scalping them. Yeah, I, this is all on PS2 as well, right? PS2, PS2, PS2. I mean, they should include that P PS3 had GTA 4. But GTA 5 is just like... The thing is, they spent... They made so much money. If you guys don't know... They spent $500 million. That's right. $500 million. Just to give you an idea, $500 million they spent. $500 million they spent developing GTA 5. End game. The Avengers end game. Budget, it's their budget wasn't even that high. I mean, mind you, they did make a billion dollars in in literally two days in sales. They made one billion dollars in revenue just in sales in two days. So, 
Yeah, and then supposedly they make a, a billion dollars annually just from doing their online stuff. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense. It used to be a lot more fun. I, I used to like GTA 5 online, well, GTA Online a lot more. Yeah, I think they should do a remaster. Maybe that's what they're working on. My grandma has played Wii Fit for every day for over 10 years. I guess that's the thing. Uh, full guys tricking a crowd can be risky. Lol. <laughs> that is absolutely insane. Ah, uh, full guys. All right, yep. Full guys, Alex. Um, help us improve Origin. Your feedback is valuable. It's kind of like fitting that I'm gonna be playing. Literally, I have Origin open. Look. <laughs> Please transfer six dollars ninety nine into my bank account to get the extra DLC called My Opinion. <sighs> I mean, true. I just passed one year working on my so solo project. Song of Iron and six months since you all changed my life and blew up my first pose. I made a ton of changes from the feedback. Oh, I think I remember seeing that. Oh, this is cool. This is like a really, uh, like, this is just looks like a beautiful game. I don't think this is a game that is up my alley, but because it's a, it's a side scroller. Uh, but I think it's so amazing when one person makes a game and especially when it does really really well like stardew valley maybe one person really really good I, I think this is sick and i think reddit is such a good place especially I, i've seen a lot of people post their stuff here like hey i'm working on a project and people give their feedback and it's super constructive and i think that maybe a better game comes out of it so that's cool it looks really pretty yeah New card from Hearthstone. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. I found this accidentally in World War Z. Thought that uh, thought that it might be funny. Wait, what? Wait, what? QR code. I'm glad I didn't play the audio. I'm just glad I didn't play the audio. I would have been rickrolled and also DMCA'd. Man, this person just... I should just learn how to draw in this style and then I'll be good. You need to take Karen's mom from point A to point B. If she can't defend herself, she... Um, she can't defend herself. She dies, you restart. Her pathfinding is awful. If she is too far from you, she dies. Her running speed is slower than your... That is the worst part. Just this part. They could just do that and I would get so frustrated. Why do they do that? They're like, their walking speed is slower than your walking speed or it's a little faster than your walking speed. So you run, but it's slower than your running speed. <sighs> My action game, Pug Champ. This holiday season, I want to buy the Xbox. Yeah. I said it was the Xbox One Series X. That's what I thought it was, but it's just the Xbox Series X. <laughs> Mad boy. I, why does it cost money to change your online name? It's so weird. Last Fallout 76 player officially deemed the loneliest person on Earth. Is Ace still playing this game? Wait, is it on Steam? Wait, I've got this? Uh, wait, I can't remember how you see. Where's the community tab? Am I actually going to have to go to my library? Pull out. Then you go like to community hub. How many people am I? 4,000? Oh. I was meant to click yes. 4,000.
All right. <laughs> I mean, I think this is wrong now, but anyway. My 79-year-old father exercises with We Fit almost every morning. Oh, that's the same as the other post, I think. Like something similar. Uh, it doesn't have the same days. <gasps> oh, I got excited. Pokemon's... I, I wonder if Pokemon, like the, the boxes, mint condition boxes for the original Pokemon's go for a lot of money. Yeah, this is why EA is like... I remember this. A lot of this is about the fiasco with Battlefront. <sighs> why... My mom with Just Dance. Just Dance is super good. How to avoid head crabs in VR. That is so cool. I really wish I had like... I, do, I don't have the room for VR. I really wish I did. Maybe in the new place I'll get an index or something. It's so cool. Why did the chicken cross the road? Because you didn't freaking cook it. <sighs> oh, speaking of this game... We will be playing uh, Hyrule Calamity. Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Uh, supposedly, it's really good for like the prequel story. So, yeah, we'll play it for sure. I'm excited. I played the demo and I loved it. I thought it was a lot of fun. So, mm, do I click this one? Yeah, that's enough. Okay, yeah. Cannonball! Is there any audio? No. Oh, I remember this. I love this po I love this post. <laughs> I tried to do this. It didn't work. It's so funny. Uh, remember when Satori... Oh, yeah. Yeah, he took a, if you didn't know this, they took a pay cut because of the commercial failure of the Wii U. <sighs> Literally, the only reason to have a Wii U is for Wind Waker HD and Twilight Princess HD. Only reason. And I, why can you come out on the Switch, please? It's been eight years. Eight years waits for all of the audience to become eighteen plus before releasing the game. <laughs> Damn. I, I forgot how long it's been. Oh, yeah. Shit. Eight eight years since it came out? Fuck. Wait. Remember my Xbox One ad concept? Wait, what? Ooh, yikes. You think the internet wouldn't find out? You think the w internet wouldn't find out? Come on, Microsoft. Yikes. 14 years of graphical improvements. Oh, I played this game. I liked it. Damn. I can't wait to see him in like 4K texture. <laughs> Ray tracing. Oh yeah, this is uh this is the song of this is the original one. This is the original post uh from that guy that we just watched. I think I remember seeing this one. And then people gave criticisms, there was five thousand comments. That was super cool. All out seventy six two hundred dollars collector's edition comes with a nine. Oh, I remember this. If you want to see a very, very, very interesting and fun video. Um, there's the internet historian and he's just hilarious. He's so good. And if you watch the, like, I mean, he makes very interesting videos and I think he's Australian. So we love, and he's got a beautiful voice. Like listen to his voice. Just in case. And everyone had that same concern. Within the week, stocks on shelves were getting noticeably low. I remember this. But yeah, I, I mean, he's great. But he did a really, really funny video. I've watched it like four times. 
um, about the fall of seventy fall of Fallout seventy six. Yeah, this one with comfy viewing, very good. I would highly recommend this channel. Uh, but yeah, and it like covers all this stuff. A friend of mine passed away recently. His parents used this as his urn. I hope he respawns into a better server next time. Aw. Wow. Okay, that's fucking cool. That's really impressive. That's such a good, like, um, memory. Like a way to... That's cool. I wonder what... <gasps> I always thought making me into a sword would be really cool. If I was cremated. There are no winners, only losers. Wait, do they both die? <laughs> wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, I need to watch this again. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's so good. Wait. How many, how big were the lobbies in Battlefield? How big, they're huge, aren't they? There's like, like 400 players or something. Not that many, but like, it feels like that sometimes. Please don't raid. I work 10 hour shifts. Holy crap. Liber yeah, okay. Hong Kong. All right. Last page. We, this is the final page. I'm working on a game where you build a, a village on a giant wandering creature. What? Oh, this is sick. Oh, this is really cool. I wonder if it will do well. This this is posted recently. I'll upload it for sure. Oh, oh, oh. Our biggest... What? It took eight months to complete. Yeah, I... um. I can't even look at that because I'll just be like, how do you even do that? Like, there's so much planning that goes into this. Most fair AI ever. This is me driving in video games on stream. But I take the inside. I take the inside. Racing lines. Racing lines. Racing lines. Somehow they have a better racing line than me. And then you all call me a shit driver. Yep. <laughs> what? There's no way. No way. No. Is this Wreckfest? Yeah, I kind of want to play this game. What the fuck? He's still going. This is me. This is the AI. And chat is saying that I it's not rigged. Oh, wait. Yeah, we already watched this. Wait, is this like an update? Oh, this is kind of cool. Actually, this is kind of like Witchet or like a prop hunt sort of thing. This could be fun. You had two posts with over like 100,000 things. Blizzard is trying to hide this clip. Uh, I don't want to watch that. No, no, no. Thank you. If you yell no loud enough, it, ha it, it works. Do I need audio? Oh yeah, some people take VR so re like. I remember the first time I did VR, I was worried to step anywhere. I remember they were like, "Oh yeah, you got to walk out onto this catwalk," and I was like, "I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not doing that." Chess counts, right? What? Oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm good at chess, I know. Sent a picture of a Final Fantasy VII character to my mom thinking she looked like her. She recreated the look and it and pretty much nailed it. Nice. Let's go. That's cute. Today I unexpectedly had to see. Oh. oh, it's a cat. Our bond is strengthened with the introduction of many humans in the house. Oh, that's cute. I wasn't so deathly allergic. I think that's one thing that I don't like about Yuna is that she sucks 
at cuddling. She's like the worst cuddle dog ever. Pigeon Simulator 2019. <laughs> the, the true game of the year. Wait, you can shit on cars and people? Why haven't I played this? A steampunk... Do I just have to... Do I have to go... Wait, where's Minecraft? Do I uninstall it? Do I uninstall it, chat? <laughs> if you can create stuff like this, I'm jealous. I made a gun that melts the environment. Oh, this is sick. I saw this. I saw this. Let me upload this because I already seen it. This is so cool. How this mechanic work in a full game? Minecraft. <laughs> Yeah, it's so cool. It just looks so nice. And gaming has come such a long way. Can I upload that? No, it's an archive post. God damn it. Yeah, I, I would really like to do that. It'd be it'd be fun. You just spend it hours just melting stuff. <laughs> what? See, I want to see from his perspective. That'd be so cool. Wait, I wonder. I wonder if uh, that person saw it. And hey, you're right. Mm, do we trust this chat? Oh, okay, no. I thought that someone would have like seen this and been like, oh my God, I was recording from my end. Sometimes that happens. Soul crushing truth. I wish I had money for the new console. Well, this, what's this behind your ear? <laughs> people, people scalping. Probably have a job. Wait, what? A 16-year-old with autism got all of his Xbox games stolen. So our local sheriff's uh, office pitched in to buy him some new games. What the fuck? Who, who the fuck steals video games? Just in general. Just in general. And let alone from someone who has autism. Like, what, what are you doing? Like, that. that's even like, you're a douchebag if you just steal video games from someone, Right. But on this level, you just like, is that just one way? That's a one way ticket to hell, right? I'm sure, I'm sure it is. I'm glad that they did. That's so nice of them. And I hope the people who stole his Xbox games got like two games and then the sheriff's department got him like the whole fucking box set. Like every video game on Xbox. Steve Jobs said it first. When the people that can make the company more successful are the sales and marketing people, they end up running the companies. And the product people get driven out of the decision-making forums. And the companies forget what it means to make great products. Well, I mean, unfortunately, I feel like this has kind of gone down like the Apple pro up Apple way. I say that, but, I, but at the same time, their new MacBooks, supposedly like their M1 chip is god tier. Like, I, I followed Marcus Brownlee, MKBHD, top-tier creator. The reason one he, why he won creator of the decade. Anyway, uh, yeah, so... He was just saying that he was, like, surfing the internet for, like, an hour, and he still had, like, 98% battery or 96% battery. But I think, I think the problem is with the mobiles, right? So... You guys saw my office works email shit. Um, I think, I think that they should do. They should release things every three years. That's that's my personal opinion. Every three years, they should release a new phone. So the the idea is that because they're like, oh, we're producing stuff that are so that you guys can, you know, 
we're being more environmentally friendly. But are you really? Are you really being environmentally friendly? I feel like you're not because you're producing so many devices and supposedly they're making them harder to repair, which means that, you know, this just goes in the trash and, you know, I, I don't know. It just, I don't like that. And I, so I had an iPhone 7 Plus, which is here, um, four year, four year difference, huge, huge difference, right? Makes sense. But I feel like every year, unnecessary. But I, I'd love to know how Steve Jobs would view Apple. Like, say, somehow we could bring people back from the dead. And then, you know, I wonder what he would say. He'd probably be like, why is my company not a trillion dollar company yet? This kid sm playing Smash Ultimate at the airport has no idea that he's playing MK Leo. The number one... I hope he lets him win. <laughs> what a, ha, Imagine it's like, I'm number one ranked in the world. Just decimates this child. <laughs> Pepe hands. Trust me, Fluffy, when you update your phone, finally. The good thing is, think about it this way. Any, any phone that you buy right now from Apple would be perfect. Would be such an upgrade. Because your iPhone 6, like some of the phones are like 500, like $400. And it it's like a good upgrade. Like if you went for to the iPhone SE, I feel like you'd be like, holy shit, this is so good. Um, and you don't have to compromise on anything. Face ID fucking sucks. It's terrible. Bring back Touch ID. Touch ID, it was just God tier. <sighs> That's good. That's really like impressive that you're just like taking hand me downs. That's actually a really smart move. Leaked Harry Potter game in development. Yeah, didn't we see something recently of it? I can't wait. Pokemon Go Survival. <laughs> Hurricane War. Different Pokemon may be appearing in your parks around you. It's a great time to explore your local parks. I'm surprised at how big Pokemon Go is still today. Some of Sasha's friends are huge into Pokemon Go. You still play it? Yeah, I'm just surprised. Every day, my parents play Mario Kart 64 to see who will make the cup of tea. They've done this religiously since 2001. Oh, it still works. Uh, I hope they still do that. That's, that's so funny. <laughs> Sasha would always make the cup of tea. All right. Um, the... Oh, no, we saw this one already. Double post. The original pay-to-win game system. Let's have a look. This is the final post that we're looking at today. I mean, they're not wrong. They're not wrong. I'm about to show you something, chat. What? Wait, you can't buy them from here? I can't remember where you buy Pokemon booster boxes. Where where is it? I I don't know. This is so insane to me. But there's literally boxes of Pokemon like first edition like these these boxes came out in 1999, right? Sealed. They're going for like $400,000. So it really is a pay to win system. It is absolutely insane. But anyway, yeah, that's been uh I mean, that's been an hour of us going through the top links all well, the top scoring links in gaming on reddit uh let me know what you think of this I, i'm interested to know do you like this maybe we could do something else maybe we could do 
cooking, a cooking one to see what the best food or something. I don't know. Uh, but if you did like it, let me know in the comments down below or in my Twitch chat at some point. Uh, but yeah, I think this is, uh, I, I like doing this stuff. I like going through and seeing, you know, what the top post of all time is in any category. But yeah, uh, again, thanks for stopping by and watching. I appreciate it. Until next time, peace.